about set to go. This is the second. Race two in KL. There's a bit of movement there. A few shouts going on in the stalls. Just about set. The flag is up. Gates open, they're racing. Gold Hill Princess was a fraction slow. Amy 11 began well. Dominate once a thief. Union Jack began fast. And Dominate heads them off soon after. In second placing once a thief. And now striding up is Emperor Warrior. He'll be outside the leader soon. Amy 11 takes the leaders back. And they were followed behind those then as they work off the back is Union Jack with Verglatica Day Flirt. Next along then, Hong Kong Dollar Roger is a fair way off them early with Immortality, Gold Hill Princess and Limbs Reunion last of all. Down the side, 800 metres left to run. Dominate shows the way by two and a half to Emperor Warrior. A length and a half to Once a Thief outside of Amy 11. They were followed by Union Jack and then came Verglatica followed by Roger. Hong Kong Dollar, Day Flirt, Gold Hill Princess, Immortality and last is Limbs Reunion. Down the lane they swing. Just over 400 100 metres to go and Dominate about to be collared now by Emperor Warrior but here comes Once a Thief looming up on the outside and Union Jack is winding up down the centre. It's now Union Jack and Once a Thief they come away from Emperor Warrior. Down the outside Verglatica and now Roger putting in the big bounds out deep. Union Jack broke away 100 to go. Down the outside Roger. Verglatica and they were followed by Once a Thief. It's Union Jack in front though and Union Jack goes on to win and Union Jack scores a length and a half to Verglatica Roger third and fourth once a thief, followed by Emperor Warrior from Hong Kong Dollar, Immortality Dominate, then Gold Hill Princess Amy 11 knocked up in the field uh, with Day Flirt and also Limbs Reunion, who was last in. So it's done a good job from one of the outside barriers, Union Jack. HS Gill rode a winner at EPO yesterday. Road uh, Great Geronimo it was. So he's had two for the weekend. This one for trainer Johnny Lim. It's done a good job from Barrier 11. And has won easily. Verglatica trying to chase it down in the shadows of the post but goes down about a length and a half and a similar gap to Roger. And uh, once a thief had his chance again today but he weakened over the final stages. So Union Jack, he'll pay 40 for the win. 18 the place. Verglatica, 12. And Roger will pay 6. 9, 11, 6. And number 3 ran fourth. And who was the favourite? It was um, Amy 11 came into race favourite, but only just. Uh, Amy 11 started 14. Roger was 15. But uh, Amy 11... Looked to be uh, quite disappointing there on face value after receiving the trail. So there's Union Jack in the red and yellow colours, red sleeves. HS Gill trying to find a position from out there. He was caught wide initially. Emperor Warrior showed a lot of speed before knocking up in the closing stages. So the winner did cover a bit of ground, uh, Union Jack. Settling about midfield and... Uh, after travelling about 300 metres, he was able to find a position closer to the rail. In fact, as they went on to the long course. And it was a very good ride too by HS Gill. Showed a bit of patience early. And uh, pulled uh, Union Jack to the outside at the right time. Storming home at the end and winning quite comfortably. So the winner, Union Jack. Number nine, a six-year-old bay gilding by All-American from Noble Concubine. Trained by Johnny Lim for J.Y. Ong. Rider was H.S. Gill. Second goes the way of number 11, Verglatica. Charles Leck for Equus Racing. Rider Rosani. And third is number six, and that is Roger. Uh, Shane Edwards for E.C. Chan. The rider was Zed Carril. And a fourth is number three, Once a Thief, Osheroos for Lawson Moy. 123.8 is the 